guitar there, Papa Molly's guitar. There it is. Tell me when you get enough in your monitor there. A little more, please. Great. Uh, do the bass, please. Actually, you know what? Yeah. I, I, I need, I need like, yeah, a, little, a little more gain on that upper end. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
I'm around me all the time She's my little sweet potato vine So I know I won't never let go. The rain of shines along my mind, wrapped around me all the time. She's my little sweet potato pie. It's really a pleasure to be here. Thank you. And please, a big hand for these beautiful musicians who... Oh! When, I, when I got here today by myself, the stage crew said, oh, is this you? I said, I, yeah, I think it is. And then uh, like, uh, one by one, it's like, oh, well, we, need, we got a, a bass. Oh, we got a fiddle. Oh, we got... It's, uh, it's, just, it's beautiful. Thank you guys for coming. That was a song called Sweet Potato Vine, and uh, 
Here's another original of mine. This is called The Story of Little Moses. And it's kind of based on, well, I'll just let you hear it. It's based on a kind it's based on some truth and some uh, and some poetic license. So. screaming shout out in the Set all you pimps and hustlers free. <laughs> My name is Moses. 
Jackson. Shade of green. This Howard Tango torn and napping. Your breath smells just like gasoline. But as I stumbled down the alleyway, I heard my brother start to sing. Go 
good man, a good man can do no wrong. Good man can do no wrong. Good man can do no wrong. Good man can stumble down the alleyway, find a little comfort in a dumpster, or shake hands with politicians in Washington, D.C. <laughs> I handle snakes in some Pentecostal church somewhere. If you're a good man, you can do no wrong. That is the story of Little Moses. I know this is such a beautiful, beautiful affair, and uh, and it's just the vibes here are just fantastic. So uh, the spirits are real high. So I want to do a song to bring you down. <laughs> this is a happy little ditty by a guy named Town Van Zant called "Waiting Round to Die." Oh, yeah. <laughs>
girl and I came of age in a Tuscaloosa bar She cleaned me out and hit it on the slide So I bought some pills to ease the pain and I got some wine and I jumped a train Better than just waiting around to die I met a friend who said he knew as an easy money was We robbed a man brother did a fly but the sheriff's pausing caught up with me took me back to Muskogee three long years of waiting around to die Nicest friend I've seen. Together we're just gonna wait around and die. So. After I do songs about murder or uh, suicide, I usually follow it up with something spiritual. So, to try to cleanse that vibe out of the air. Because we all spiritual people up in here, whether we realize it or not, I think, you know? <laughs> okay. And this is a song, this is an old spiritual song called I Shall Not Be Moved. And I always dedicate this to my friends and family who are down in New Orleans trying to rebuild that city. And, uh, it's getting better all the time. I don't know if y'all have been lately, but don't be afraid to go. They, you know, they need, they need, they need the tourist dollars for one thing, and plus, it's, it's, you'll have a wonderful time. But uh, there is a lot of work to be done, and Lord have mercy. This song's going out to all them folks back home. I got to tune up just a little bit. Sorry, the humidity is. You know, if it's not the heat, it's the stupidity. If it's not one thing, it's your mother. Jesus. Well, at least I didn't say fuck on the mic. Oh shit, I said. Oh! <laughs> I always preface my spiritual songs by cursing. That's my trademark. I'm gonna set this one up, and it's kind of, 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 it's not too tricky, but just watch it. It's, it's kind of a standard gospel. I'll set it up.
shall not, I shall not be moved like a tree that's planted by the water. I shall not be moved in my time of darkness. I shall not be moved in my time of darkness. I shall not be moved like a tree.
<laughs> but there's one thing what I do. I use up my time and I get to play for beautiful folks like y'all and with beautiful musicians like this. I want to make it last as long as I can. Is that okay with y'all? Yeah! yeah. yeah. I'm not everybody. I'm See, this, is the, this is the best part of our job. I mean, and it really is a job sometimes when you're stuck in airports and you're away from your family and the people you love. And stuff. That's when it seems like a job. When it's up here, it feels like church. <laughs> In the best sense of the word, too. I don't care what it is. It's religious belief on but, you know, church, like a community. And like a, like a uplifting. Yay! I got a, let's see. Tiger fan! Woo! Okay, I got a song. I got to change two minutes, though. Take just one second. Mississippi, but I grew up in Shreveport, Louisiana, Woo! most of my childhood. Right across the river, there's this place called Bozier City, which is, by all accounts, <laughs> I'm not trying to diss anybody or diss the city, but from the time I was old enough to understand English, I was warned about Bozier City, you know? It's like Shreveport being this conservative kind of Bible Belt southern town, and, and here across the river was the, the den of inequity, you know? <laughs> you know, yeah, and, and yeah, it's where it was where like they had they had an air force base there, so they had like a lot big a thing they called the Bozier Strip, which was like a miniature little like uh, Las Vegas, lots of nightclubs with uh, casinos and you know topless stripper joints and all kinds of stuff. It was, it was it was quite quite the blight on on the people who you know really were worried about that sort of thing back then. So um, when I got to be of age where I was really kind of interested in girls, there's this guy in my neighborhood, and his name is Vic, and we all think he's the coolest guy in the neighborhood because he's got a cool car, you know, he's got a jacked up Nova, and he's always working on it in the, in the driveway, he's really, he's really, you know, really quiet, he doesn't say much, always got a pack of cigarettes rolled up in his white t-shirt and looking cool, and so one day he's letting us watch him work on his car, and I said, hey Vic, um, you know, 
Uh, what's your secret with the girls, man? He goes, let me tell you something. Them girls in Bozier City, they's mean, but they give. <laughs> Swear to God. So, that was my first advice on love. <laughs> Fortunately, my grandmother said, no, 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 read this book of poetry. <laughs> <laughs> so that story has basically nothing to do with this song, except that they both have the name Buzzer City. <laughs> They're both kind of about Buzzer City. Okay. So this, is called, this song is called The Girls of Buzzer City.
people And Jack is gonna ride them in the park Ponies down the street, Paul And Jack is gonna ride them Ride them in the park Girls in both the city Driving to the great park for a lark Ride you like a diamond studded corner Ride you Ride you Like a And leave you like a black dog And leave you like a black dog and leave you like a black door in the dark. Woo! Yeah. Yeah. Woo. Okay. We had a wonderful time, y'all. Please give it up for these fine musicians. Greenman from Green Mountain Grass. This is Jesse and Pickle. Carlito on percussion, Scott Long on guitar. Cherry fingerprints on melodica and piano. You sound wonderful over there, brother. Okay. All right. And my name is Papa Molly, just in case you missed that. This is one, it's kind of my reworking of a, of an old tune, you know, a really old song. This is something that comes like from Appalachian, Appalachian kind of music, mountain music. It's been redone by a lot of people, John Cash and Hank, Hank Three did for him or something. I don't know who else has done it, a lot of people. Mom and Blake. But I do it, I do it totally different than everybody else. I do it. Like a Mardi Gras Indian chant. And it's, it's, uh, the, song, the original song is called yeah. Little, Little Sadie, but I changed it up so much for that I went ahead and just changed the name and went, what the hell is it? You know, but I always give credit where it's due. That's uh, what you do. That's right. Mm. So this one's called Early in the Morning. Remember the night 
second shot, say it down. Well, early in the morning, sing along. Yeah, early in the morning, sing along. Early in the morning, early in the morning. Early in the morning. 